and you see LeBron James mashing in warm-ups. Having fun, getting loose, getting ready to go at Big Baby. Oh, Glenn Davis and Jason Maxiel in the throwbacks, just like oh, these oh, used to wear nice. in the day. Oh, oh my oh, goodness. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yeah, sir. Matt Geiger, take that, Matt Geiger. <laughs> yes, sir. You put Geiger counter into the rim. I love it. Rashard Lewis, 10 of his 18 points came in the first quarter. Rashard Lewis, a veteran guy. You stick him in the lineup, you have to guard him, and he made plays tonight. Jameer Nelson had a solid game, 21 points, 6 assists, and Orlando at 18-15. LBJ with the steal. Michael Beasley floats at home. Be easy to play as pretty good basketball lately, playing with confidence. And then it's an alley oop, Norris Cole to Dwayne Wade. Well, they do that as good as anybody, always looking for the back door, the easy ones. Beasley had 13 tonight playing well, and Wade's really picked his game up when he's healthy. Jameer to Tobias Harris. How did he fit that one in there? Oh, this is a nice pass, good catch, good finish. Mario Chalmers, 4 3 at halftime. Miami led 48 46. Miscommunication there defensively. Orlando's got to pick that up. They could have switched that guard position. Rashard Lewis here channeling his inner Jamal Crawford, the all time leader in four point plays. Book Book one for Richard. Yeah, book one for Richard. Being ready to shoot the basketball. The king being unselfish. Chris Bosch, the J. Miami up seven. And then he would come back and do it again. Bosch playing very good basketball. Nine for nine tonight. Just plays his role. Knows how to play the game and feeds off the other guys. That was part of a 19 to two heat run. And then watch Mo Harkless oh. get above the rim. Great pass, but Mo jumped to the rim, young man. I like the one and done aspect of that jam as well. Fourth quarter now. D. Wade, uh-uh. Chris Anderson, uh-huh. Energy man off the bench, the bird man flying through the air there, tapping in what he needs to finish up on the miss. LeBron only had 15, 8, and 8. Well, sometimes LeBron said, you know what? Since y'all playing so well, I'll share the wealth, take the night off. The Heat beat the Magic 110-94. Miami is 25 and 8, 11 and 5 away from home. They shoot 54% from the field as the big three combines for 55 of Miami's 110. Orlando drops to 10 and 23, and it was the second straight DNP for Nick Vucevic out with an ankle injury. So, Vinny, you mentioned Chris Bosh's 9 for 9, scores 20 points in this game. Does he get enough credit? Probably not. But all the attention, a lot of it is obviously with LeBron and Wade. But Bosch fits the role. He has to guard centers. He's really a power forward. But he can pip him, pick and pop. He opens up the floor. But, I mean, he had 37 last week in a big win when he needed to step up. He did. Eight-time All-Star. Has Olympic gold medals. Couple championships. He's done a lot in this game. Now he's in a perfect situation. Feeding off those other guys. Doesn't have to be the main man every night. But when you need him, he's been there for him. Rick, he loves his role. People forget in Toronto, he was a 20-10 guy every night, took 25, 27 shots a night. Now you go to Miami, you're playing with the King, you're playing with D-Wade, you're playing a system where everybody's unselfish, the ball is moving, so you don't have to call a lot of plays for Bosch because he can make shots. I'm very impressed with that, knowing that you come from one place, you're an all-star, you were the man, now you go over here and play with uh, future Hall of Famers, and you're still the man. And don't look now, but Chris Bosch is building a potential Hall of Fame resume with eight consecutive All-Star appearances, career averages of 19.3 points and 8.8 .8 rebounds in the two championships that coach was talking about.